Hi there, I'm Anushka and today I will be talking about this beautiful book The World Shines For You by Jeffrey Burton illustrated by Don Clark. Um, so it's got these raised bits in the book. Um, I should have really looked up the word for what this is called but you can see the way the sunlight shines off the different aspects of this and there's like um, you know different raised parts of the book that the the child can touch so it's like a touch feel book and uh, really detailed illustrations of this tree flowers birds all through the book and it's um, shiny kind of material so that the light can glint off the book um, as they hold it in the light in the Sun and we see um, this shimmering effect going through the book uh, and really dig into all the detailed illustrations like we've got a mama bear and a baby bear here there's a, a couple of foxes there's deer there's the birds in the trees and all this wildlife in the forest um, lots of geometric simple shapes in the book circles squares triangles so you could uh, go through the book and, and ask your child can you find all the triangles on this page and then spend some time counting all of the triangles count all the circles we'll say oh can we count all the red circles on this tree you know um, Look at shapes, colors, numbers, lots of different concepts that we can use this book to teach. Um, I really like all the different shaped leaves on this page. So we can talk about there being spiky leaves, shiny leaves, smooth leaves, um, you know, uh, spindly leaves, uh, curvy leaves, different types of leaves on this page. When you go for a walk, you can pick up different types of leaves and then say, uh, you know, oh, remember my book or, or bring them back home and look at them with the book and say these leaves look like this one or these leaves look like that one and hold the leaves up against the book and, and see uh, what different leaves you can collect on your walk. Um, and then we have this vibrant, uh, warm colored page with uh, there are clouds in the sky and so many different cumulus beautiful clouds here and the sun my son likes to point out the sun and he is obsessed with looking at the moon outside at the moment on our walks constantly pointing out the moon then we have in the sky and there's all these different things up in the sky there's a blimp there's a hot air balloon uh, helicopters airplanes airplanes are another thing he likes to point out so this is all very exciting for him birds planes moon lots of things in the sky then we have some cold colors on this page um, i just really like the way that the light reflects off these snowflakes um, and like the shiny shiny bits of the snowflakes it's really fun um, the shimmering effect um, there's not a lot of words but there's a lot of pictures and it's more of just the texture and touching and feeling this book um, as you can see the roots just sinuously like winding its way um, uh, sinuously sorry winding its way through through the ground um, I really like the way that the roots go through the letters as well and there are seeds underground we look at all the things underground and there's the people above the ground little boots and and skis and sleds people up there because it's cold and there's these bears hibernating and we can talk about animals going to sleep for the winter yeah and then we have there are flowers in the field and we're back to like a very spring timey page and there's lots of different flowers um, you can point at all the different flowers that you see like you could say you know these ones are tulips and these are roses and these are chrysanthemums and these are daisies and just make up the names for the different aspects of the book um then we have there are lights in the city and there's lots of cool different lights and there's people and their houses here and we can see someone is playing with the plane this person's playing with the car this person has an ice cream lots of lights in the city um and cars going across this bridge and there are lights in the country and we see the moon up here and the hills the houses lots of lights in the country um, there's an alpaca here which I'm not quite sure where this is set and there's fireflies um, and then we have there are stars
stars up above and we see this beautiful sun and all of the stars in the sky and these two kids stargazing and all the world shines for you and i love this center kind of page um the symmetry of this page um and the little shiny bits just all over beautiful um really fun interesting well quite different from anything that i have seen previously and uh, your child might enjoy all the colors and shining and shimmering within this book um so yeah highly recommend all the world shines for you it is quite heavy so if you have a child who likes to pick up and everything mine is getting quite frustrated at the moment that he can't pick up and throw this book uh which is probably a good thing um but that is one aspect of this this book that i challenge a very determined little one thank you